Dry fasting is intense, and the results are drastically quick. People claim the benefits of fasting develop with regular, and repeated sessions. But it's believed that dry fasting delivers the fastest results because it's the most extreme. This video will discuss the steps you take before, during, and after your first dry fast. Watch the video and let us know your experience with dry fasting. There is evidence that dry fasting causes weight loss. Ramadan is a holy month, during which Muslims abstain from all food and drink from sunrise to sunset every day. A study of 240 people who fasted for at least 20 days during Ramadan, found that after Ramadan, body weight and body mass index BMI, decreased in everyone. Dry fasters are claiming they abstained from water for up to 5 days and felt completely fine. That many days of dry fasting is not really recommended. A beginner should start with no longer than 12 hours of intermittent fasts, and by no means exceed 24 hours. Dry fasting is intense, and the results are drastic. Here are some exemplary items to perform before your first dry fast. Always consult with a doctor before starting a dry fast to see if it's safe for you to complete. If you start feeling symptoms of dehydration, such as dizziness, lightheadedness, or a fever, quit the dry fast immediately and drink water. Don't attempt to dry fast for longer than 24 hours. The benefits of losing weight are not worth the health risks. Dry fasting is not recommended as a long-term weight loss solution, although it eliminates water weight fat, and bodily toxins. Again, the benefits are not worth the potential health risks. Medical direction and consultation are required. Dry Fasting – Steps for Preparing for the Dry Fast 1. You can begin with a juice or water fast to build up to your dry fast. A juice fast allows you to drink water throughout your day. Choose one day to try a juice fast and see how it affects your body. Follow that with a day of eating as usual. Alternate between fast days and days where you usually eat. You may start a dry fast after completing 4 to 5 water or juice fasts if you feel comfortable. Check with your doctor first before fast to ensure it doesn't affect existing medical conditions. 2. If you're new to dry fasting, choose a soft one. If you've never done any dry fasts before, start with a soft dry fast. Since your skin absorbs moisture from the air, you are less likely to become dehydrated. If you have tried soft dry fasts, you may do a harder dry fast. Do not do a hard dry fast unless you feel comfortable. No brushing of teeth with hard dry fast. And no showers. 3. Start by eating a diet high in omega-3 fatty acids and salt. These foods take longer to digest, which means you don't feel as hungry after you start fasting. Salt can help you retain vitamins, minerals, and other healthy functions. Your body might naturally lose them while you fast if you don't. It is also possible to use a fish oil supplement before starting your fast. This allows your body to process it as you move. 4. Do not go into a dry fast with too many toxins in the body as it can increase the chances of feeling fatigued. The best way to prepare for a dry fast is to hydrate properly in the days leading up to it. If you work Monday through Friday, I recommend starting the 24-hour dry fast, Friday night. Beginning Friday night would end the 24-hour dry fast Saturday night, which would give your body all day Sunday to recover.
1. The 16 to 24 hour fast means that you will stop eating and drinking for 16 to 24 hours. A dry fast should be done for no more than one day. After that, it should be continued with regular eating. This will set an achievable goal and keep your body hydrated. Although some have been dry fasting for as long as 3 days or longer, it's important to avoid fasting for more than 24 hours because severe dehydration is likely. 2. Do low energy activities throughout your fast. You won't be able to drink any fluids or eat food. For a distraction from hunger and thirst, try relaxing at your home with calming activities like yoga or meditation. Light exercises are good options, such as walking around a block or dumbbell curls using low weights. Write down what your body is feeling and record it with the fast. Three, when you feel tired, take a break and rest. Sleeping can curb your cravings and help you retain your energy. Try walking around your home and doing light stretches when you get outside. You can take short naps throughout your day if you feel too tired. 4. If you feel dizzy, lightheadedness or dizziness, it is essential to drink water. Do not wait until you feel dizzy or unbalanced and drink water right away to hydrate. Other signs and symptoms of dehydration are, rapid heartbeat, less frequent urination, low blood pressure, and low blood sugar. If you feel any one of these symptoms, break your fast immediately. 5. Exercise. Regular exercise is possible even during a dry fast. But it would be best if you remembered that dry fasts could cause severe physical and mental stress. The body can become irritated if it is pushed beyond its limits. When fasting for the first time, it is recommended that your body take some time to adjust. One, after you have finished your fast, slowly drink 16 ounces, 470 milliliters of water. To avoid overwhelming your system, you should take small sips from the glass. You can swirl the water around in your mouth to coat it well before swallowing. Stop drinking water after the glass is empty. Bloating can result from drinking water quickly after fasting. Two, drink another 16 ounces of water, 470 milliliters every hour after breaking your fast. This will help to rehydrate and prevent bloating. As you drink the water, take small sips. During the first few days after your fast, you can continue to have 16 ounces, 470 milliliters water. You'll feel more energy as you drink. Continue drinking water for three to four hours. 3. Start your fast exiting period with small amounts of healthy food. You should always follow the instructions on the packaging to ensure you don't overeat after your fast ends. Keep eating light snacks throughout the day. After approximately one day, you will be able to eat normally again. 4. Avoid eating foods high in sodium and carbs for at most two days. Avoid eating cured meats. Cured meats include uncooked, for example, bacon, dry ham, and cooked cured meats, for example, luncheon meat, and frankfurters. Start with foods low on sodium, carbs, fat and calories. After eating normally, it is best to use very little or no seasoning. 1 example is a plain cooked chicken breast with vegetables. There are some great benefits to dry fasting. 
Again, dry fasting is intense, and the results are drastically quick. People claim the benefits of fasting develop with regular and repeated sessions. But it's believed that dry fasting delivers the fastest results because it's the most extreme. This video has discussed the steps you take before, during, and after your first dry fast. Please leave us comments after your first dry fast or your last dry fast if you regularly perform this diet. Thank you.